Good morning to you all. Today I am going to teach you chapter 4 subtraction and the topic is subtraction of two digit numbers and this is video number 2. Our students chapter 4 subtraction and the topic is subtraction of two digit numbers. See one example I have given you. Yes subtract 52 from 91. So students you have already completed yesterday subtraction of one digit number from a two digit number and today we are going to start subtraction of two digit numbers so what we have to do first yes we have to write these numbers in the column so make a column now write these numbers subtract 52 from 91 so here we will write 91 and here we will write 52. You all students know that 91 is a bigger number and it is known as minute and 52 is a smaller number and this is known as subtrahend. So what we have to do students now? Yes, we have to subtract. So student, you all know 1 is less than 2. So, is it possible? Yes, to subtract 2 from 1? No. Then what we will do? We will borrow from 9 tens. Okay? See, then regroup 9 tens, 1 ones as 8 tens. So, we will he write here 8 tens. And this will, 1 will become 11 ones. Okay students, now what we have to do? Now we will subtract 2 ones from 11 ones. Yes, 2 ones from 11 ones. So, 11 minus 2 is equals to? Very good, 9. Now, we will write 9 under the ones column. Again, come to next at the tens place. Yes, subtract 5 tens from 8 tens. So students, 8 Minus 5 is equals to? Yes, 3. So, write here 3. See, students. So, we have written 3 under tens column. See, 91 minus 52 is equals to 39. So, students, one more example I am giving you to do. Okay. Now, write the, see the next example. Yes, subtract 65 from 83. So again student, what we have to do? Yes, we have to arrange these numbers in the column. So arrange these numbers. Here, subtract 65 from 83. As a bigger number, yes, 83 we will write here. And smaller number, 65, we will write here. Okay, students? Now, subtract this. So, is it possible to subtract 5 from 3? No. So, what we will do? Yes. From 8 tenths. Yes. So, students, what you have to do? Yes, regroup 8 tens and 3 ones as 7 tens and 13 ones. Okay, students? Yes, very good. Now, subtract 5 ones from 13 ones. So, students, 13 minus 5 is equals to? Yes, very good. 8. Now, come to that tens. Okay, what you have to do here, students? Yes, you have to subtract 6 from 7. So, what you will do? 6 tens from 7 tens. Yes. So, students, 7 minus 6. Very good. 1. See, students, 83 minus 65 is equals to 18. Now, students, some questions I am giving you from your book. Okay, checkpoint 2. 
So students start, subtract the following numbers. So we have to subtract 55 from 63. So see, 3 minus 5, it is not possible. So what we will do? Yes, we will borrow from 6. So this will become, 3 will become 30 and 6 will become 5. Now come to the ones place students. Yes. Now subtract 13 minus 5 is equals to very good 8. And 5 minus 5 students. Yes 0. So here we will write 0. Come to the next. Yes. What we have to do here again we will subtract 29 from 79. So 9 minus 9 students. Very good. 9 minus 9, 0. And 7 minus 2, very good. 5. So here we will write 5. So 79 minus 29 is equals to 50. Students, here next question. Yes, 38 from 54. You have to subtract 38 from 54. So what we will do students here? Is it possible to subtract four, uh, 8 from 4? No. So, again we will borrow from 5. Means from 5 pens. So, here the one, uh, 4 at one's place will become 14 and here 5 tens will become 4. Now, students come to the one's place. Yes. So, 14 minus 8 is equal to 6. So, 6 we will write under one's column. And come to the tens place. So, 4 tens minus 3 tens. Yes. Here we will write 1 ten. So students, 54 minus 38 is equals to 16. Now come to the last question. Yes. What we have to do here again? Subtract 19 from 37. So is it possible to subtract 9 from 7? No. Again, what we will do? We will borrow from tens place, from 3. Again, students, 7 at 1's place will become 70 and 3 at tens place will become as 2 tens. 3 tens will become as 2 tens. 7 ones will become as 17 ones. Now, 17 minus 9. Yes, students? 8. Yes. So, here we will write... 8 under 1 column and 2 tens minus 1 ten. 10 is equal to student? Yes. 1. So, 37 minus 19 is equal to 18. So, students, today I have taught you subtraction of 2 digit numbers. Now, I am giving you homework to do in your application book. So students, write down your homework. Worksheet 4.2 Question number A Page number 41. So students, do your homework in your application book.